couch Dogs need adolescents Hey there, Lickin' Riffers, how are you doing? Welcome to a very special installment of our improvisation and soloing series where I'm gonna share with you a jam session that I had with my good friend and amazingly talented musician, Erez, who you might recognize from our band, How To's. We just met and we had a jam session, as we usually have when we meet, and we filmed it, as we usually do, because sometimes during jam sessions, really incredible things happen and we can use it to study what we did and what occurred so we can uh, benefit from what happened instead of just forgetting it. And what happened during that jam session was amazing. We started by playing a blues, just a simple blues, a 12 bar blues, when suddenly after a few minutes it suddenly got turned into a Spanish piece. Why? Because uh, we ended the blues and I suddenly added the flat 9. I didn't mean to, I just added an extra note to the chord and it was a mistake, but it was the flat 9 and Erez heard it and he played something over that flat 9 chord and I heard something Spanish in it, so I reacted. And I want you to watch that um, and I'm gonna add subtitles to it. So you can study what we did and I'm gonna direct your attention to what we're doing and how we're listening to one another. Now, I don't care if we make mistakes or play, uh, you know, or stumble during that improvisation, even though I don't think we did much, but if we did horribly, then I'm gonna cut it and crossfade it and I'm gonna explain it in the subtitles so you don't laugh at me too much. Um, but. I want you to listen and I want you to, uh, to see what we did and how we listened to one another and how we took risks so something amazing happened and we suddenly started playing the same thing and took our blues improvisation into a completely different sphere of music. And it happened spontaneously, we didn't plan on it. So um, I wish you a lot of fun with this and now I'll... Um, Crossfade to the improv. Enjoy. <laughs> 